you do know that Pac is the only reason why Jada was in that movie, right? In what movie? Minister Society. That's not why she was in Minister. Who said that? Oh, uh, she said it, yeah. Let me see if I can find this shit. Tell me, read what she's saying. I don't remember that. No, I'm about to show you. But she came, she came, she came, she she came, a few people came in to read for, to be my girlfriend. She came in and, and read to be my girlfriend, and we we was like, that's the one. I don't know about, uh, she wasn't a star yet to say that she's going to be in a movie and not be in a movie. Yeah, she claims that um the only reason why she was in that movie was um because of Pac. That's, that's not accurate. I'm telling you that's not accurate. That's not accurate. Me and Allen talk. Me and, me and Allen, we talked about this. We, um, I don't know what she's doing if the go, but I'm about to show you. That's not true. The girl came in from uh, what's the girl from um, house party? The black, the uh, play. Uh, she was in Baby Boy. Um, play Tyrese. Uh, play Tyrese Mama in Baby Boy. Yeah, she muscular as hell now. But you talking about AJ Johnson? AJ Johnson was a AJ Johnson came in, I think. AJ Johnson came in, Jasmine Guy. Um they came in to be my girlfriend. And it was gonna be AJ at first until Jada came in. And then when Jada came in, the chemistry was just there. We me and Alan looked at each other and said, That's it. That's real shit. Right, right. Now nah, I hear you, man, but um, you know, we're about to see right now, man. I'm about to show you this video. Before you can see, I'm not tripping, man. Check your phone, yo. Yeah, okay, uh, jumping ahead, because I mean, you've done so much. Talking about like the acting career. You, mm -hmm. you make your film debut in Menace to Society. It's yeah. a hell of a place to start a yeah, film career. Yeah, sure. Talk to me about, like, did it feel like there was a group of young African-American actors that you felt like a, a kinship with? Absolutely. Yeah. I mean, that was, that was the golden age of like young black Hollywood. And I'll tell you, I got Menace to Society through Tupac. Tupac was... Um, a part of Menace to Society first, and he was the one that put me on. He was the one that called the Hughes brothers and was like, you gotta meet my homegirl, Jada. You know what I'm saying? And he called me, he was like, I'm part of this movie, I really think you'd be great for this role. And I was like, word, so I went and I met them. We clicked, and so I got the role, so I'm thinking, oh, me and Pac are gonna work together for our first <laughs> movie, right? Of course, Pac has a fallen out, right. <laughs> you know, with the Hughes brothers, but what was, so dope, because I was good. I was like, well, if you're not doing it, I'm not doing it. He's like, nope, I'm not playing that game. Yeah. You need to do this film. And that was my first big break. Pac obviously often comes up in conversation with you. Do, do you think about him, or is it people like me that bring him up, that, that put him in your mind? Oh, there's not a day that goes by that I don't think about Pac. Yeah. I think about him every single day. Not many relationships like that in a, in a life, right? Absolutely. So, I don't, I, yeah, I don't I don't remember that. So, I, I that's not, maybe she, I don't know that part of it. So I just know that she came in. Maybe he told her that she should go in for it, but she definitely auditioned. That's for sure, because she read to be my girlfriend. She read words. So I don't so I don't know what that means. And, and AJ was the one that, that, that they were leaning for at first, and then Jada came in and knocked it out the park, and then it. we was like, oh, that's the, that's the one. I, I said, Alan, that's the one. I mean, hey, I don't know, man. I mean, that's what she's saying, man. You think she lying? You think she's saying it for attention? All I could go on is that for this particular project right here, I knew exactly what happened because I was there. I play Kane. Don't you think I would know exactly what happened? I'm asking you. Yeah, so I know exactly what happened. She came in in red and she killed it and she got the role. It was going to be either her or AJ Johnson. That's the but truth. what she's saying is, you know, Tupac is the one that told her about the movie. So she would have never knew about the movie to audition for the movie if it wasn't for Pac. So. No, she got the role because she came in and auditioned and did a great job. But he told her about the audition, though. Probably. So I, 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 I couldn't. I don't. I, I That's can't what disagree. she said. I'm not sure. He could have told her that. He could have told her that. I'm not saying she, she, he didn't say that part of it, but she auditioned and she got the she 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 got the role and when Tupac left out of the 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 room when when he didn't get the role when when they got to with the Hughes brother when he left out and never came back in she didn't leave out the motherfucker mm, I mean now that's a good point I mean if you saying that you and Tupac were so close and you know you see him get into it with Alan Hughes and he leave out the table reading you know you would think that you know you would follow behind him if y'all so close so 
you know, good point. That's all I'm saying. I don't know what they talked about, and that's fine. That she killed the role. She was great in it. And when they got into it that day, she didn't leave out the motherfucking room. That's all I know. And I'm glad she, I'm happy she didn't do it because it was great, fantastic.